Welcome back to the Daily Vault Run. Today is September 30th, 2024, and we have a Cake Vault Stone, or actually I think it's called a Glazed Vault Stone, and that means we're going into the Fabled Cake Vault today. I've never actually been in a Cake Vault, so this could either be fantastic or disastrous. We don't know yet. Uh, tomorrow's stone looks like a fairly hefty load, relatively speaking, but I think I can manage that in a timely fashion. I actually am not too keen on the flower component, though, because that means I'm going to need to pick up a lot of flowers. Anyway, that's fine. Um, the gunpowder component could also be a bit of a nightmare, just because I haven't done a whole lot of creeper farming. But anyway, the vault cake crystal is just pink. Well, I guess that makes sense. It's a specific type of vault. Oh, and the portal changes color too. You know, I didn't notice when I made the elixir and brazier crystals if, uh, if that does that too. So, let's get on in there. Is it literally just eat cake? I think it's literally just eat cake. Um All right. Uh where where's my last thing? I need my last Was that it? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Um Well, um Okay, so it's just eat cake. Hold on. It was at this point in editing that I think I made a realization about how I should have run this vault and the TLDR is I should have been faster. And I'll explain when I get to the part where I get stuck. Oh, wait, no, is that... Yeah, no, that, that is how that works. Increases mob damage, speed, shards... Oh, boy. Okay, so it increases a lot of stuff. This is probably going to go horribly. I'm not even going to loot the braziers today. Anyway, uh, let's, let's get in there. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. I don't know what to expect here, and I think I'm actually going to use my Acacia today, just because I think it stands out just a little bit more. Uh, consume to complete the vault. Okay, so this is effectively the exit, I, I guess? Oh, no. Okay. So it's a stacking thing. That's... I really need to stop hair trigger healing. <laughs> okay, so otherwise this is straight up just a normal vault. It's that the difficulty scales with the amount of cakes I eat, I, I guess? Oh, wait a minute. Okay, I think I'm picking up what they're putting down. I think I might actually have to eat a certain number of cakes in order to unlock that pedestal and leave the correct way. Otherwise, I might have to flee? But I could be wrong. I could be wrong. It could just be... I just eat that last crate to complete the vault. I, I don't know how it works. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna save that for closer to end time. You know, maybe when I have, like, a minute left on the clock, I want to be back in this room, potentially. No, nope, that's not what I wanted. Darn it. Well, darn it! Okay. Eh. Oh, boy. Uh, oh, have I been? No, I haven't. Okay. And I also haven't been downstairs yet, I don't think. Oh yeah, no, but this is good, because I keep forgetting that I didn't uh, have vault silver or anything like that. Or in my bag, that is. So, wait, there's more up here, isn't there? Yes, there is. Over through here. Living chests! Let's go! Ow. Ow. Stop hitting me. Uh, that took off some of my buffs, so I'm gonna have to be careful until we get enough MP back. At the very least, I would be satisfied to escape this vault, you know what I mean? Just, uh, just because we need enough 
for another, uh, what is it, ability point? No, you don't. There is technically still that one area up top, but I'm not even fussed about that. I just want to keep moving at this point. And I almost kind of feel like I need to start... Wait, was? Hold on. Wait, what? This is where I came in, right? Yeah, it is. So, that's just bedrock. This vault has an actual path. Whoa. 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 I... What? This vault has actual structure? It's not just a grid? Uh, um, uh, my mind is being blown here. I think the goal might legitimately just be run through, eat all the cakes. I think that might be the case, yeah. And there is very clearly... Wait, what? But... Oh, 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 I came from here. That makes more sense. Um... Okay, so we have a few living chests in this room. That's obviously the exit. Oh, boy, that sucked. Oh, ow. Oh, I keep pushing buttons that I don't mean to push. I should have saved that heal for just a little bit. Oh, my God. I don't even have my buffs still. I need to, I need to like, flee just a little bit so that I can put the buffs on and then, then keep doing normal stuff. At the very least, I want my turtle, and I want my smite, because that's the one that absorbs, and I'm getting the feeling, just the smallest inkling, that there is one of those cake things in every single room. So the goal isn't necessarily to blindly forge ahead. It is to strategically get as many rooms in as I think I can handle, and then eat the cake. I think that's the case. I could be wrong, but I think that's the goal. I know, you totally- Whoa! Ow. Okay, so there's a ranged somebody in there. Yeah, okay, I can- I can hear the bow and arrow at this point in time. Oh boy. Ow. I am once again asking to stop making wolves the bad guys in video games. Okay, my buffs are off again because I got smacked. Okay, I think that's just like kind of a bug in vanilla Minecraft, where you like kind of walk forward at just the right time, and you deflect an arrow by walking into it. I... it's always fun when it happens, but I don't think it's supposed to happen. <laughs> uh, is that it? I think... okay, I think they're all good. I almost kind of want to save that god altar, and I'm pretty sure it's Wendar, if I'm remembering correctly. But I think I want to save the god altar for, like, right at the end. Or, not right at the end, right at the end, but I mean, like, ten minutes on the clock. Uh, but on the other hand, if I feel like I have any chance of actually completing the objective, I should pop it now. So... The question is, am I feeling lucky, punk? Am I? And the answer is no. No, I'm not. <laughs> oh, excellent. Yes, very good. I had vaguely forgotten about that. Even though I commented on it, like, right in the beginning of this, uh, vault run. I totally forgot that I was looking for silver shards. Uh, alright. Worst that can happen is I fail it. Kill dungeon mobs. Wait. Oh, dungeon mobs. Not vault mobs. Dungeon mobs. 
maps. So that means I need to find a dungeon. That's not great. That's not the best. Because, I mean, first that necessitates that I find a dungeon. And, again, we're in the game mode where you are intentionally trying to make it more difficult for yourself. At least if I'm interpreting the rules correctly. Dang it! Seriously? Okay. Uh, there we go. I'm not the best at parkour. Um, I don't know if I can dodge up there yet. No! Seriously? Off the bounce? Uh, do I have anything I can pillar with? Uh, not really. I have two blocks. Technically, I could use the shulker to pillar. Technically. I'm not going to, but... Okay. I think if I do this, and then I do, uh, this? Okay, that's not bad. How did I miss? I missed my own parkour. How, how did I? I set the dang thing up. How did I miss that? I got the corner jump on freaking ice. And then I get to the bone block and I, yeah, okay. That's more like it. Sheesh. What is, I am just so, what? Living strong box. That's different. What does that mean? Does that mean you need like a key or something? I think that means you need like a key or something. And that's another one. Okay, um, I guess I'm not getting those. Um, let's see, I did say I think there was one more on the other side of all this. Oh, ow. No, no, no. Okay. I think I can probably go one maybe two well okay it actually really depends because if i'm just rushing for rooms then i feel like i can absolutely just run very deep into this place but the thing is you're supposed to not just run all the way in you're supposed to like do normal vault stuff oh an ore room okay wait i sense vindicators I sense Vindicators. Where? But where, though? I need you to, like, try to track me just a little bit more than that, guys. Okay, I've gotten rid of the cake haze. This is potentially a really bad idea. Oh, yep. Oh, boy. Okay, first, gain a little bit of distance. Then, javelin through the crowd. Not the best use to javelin. Ow. 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 Oh boy, I think healing is... No, I don't have enough MP to heal. That's what it is. Okay, I'm gonna back off a little bit more. Okay, I can back off and heal. There we go, nice. Okay, uh, that was a little terrifying. I think some of them stopped pathfinding after me. That's okay, I don't mind if they leash. I also will readily admit to being just a little bit of a coward. But hey, I survived. That's the more important part of all this. I lived it. I feel like there's got to be something in Sun Tzu's arsenal about, like, if you acknowledge when to retreat, you will fight many more battles than those who stay and fight. <laughs> or something. I don't know. Oh, that's so many people. That's so many guys. Holy carp. Um, um, oh, they're blocking the exit. They're blocking me. Oh, no. Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna run on through. Because I don't like any of that. I don't... I don't like any of that. Thank you. Come on. Yeah, that's right. Line up. Line up. I feel like that hit more things. 
Nope, still don't have healing back. It's the Vindicators, really. It's the Vindicators that are freaking me out more than anything else. Nope, it's the falling. It's the falling that's freaking me out more than anything else. Oh, I've fallen into a corner. Nope, this is bad. This is so bad. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I don't even know how to explain it fully, you guys, but the closest words I have are uh, my neurons are vibrating out of my body. Like, the tension is uh, so thick you could use it as the knife. Which, at first glance, you would think isn't terribly thick, or whatever, right? Because knives aren't particularly thick. But then when you consider the tension itself is a metaphysical construct, it has to be thick enough that you've gone from the imaginary plane, or the metaphysical plane, into the physical dimension and are capable of using it as a knife, like... Ugh, oh, jeez. Oh, okay. I know some of the mobs, like, easily just got stuck or whatever. Oh no, there's still more in here. There are fewer in here, don't get me wrong. Like, that's better. But there still are more, and there are more spawning in here, too. The heck. Uh, how much time do I have? Ten minutes? Yeah, unfortunately, I haven't seen a dungeon thus far. And I think this is probably, well, this room or the next room are probably going to be the last, like, rooms, I think. Just because of the increasing difficulty thing. Oh. Oh, man, you have no idea the anxiety spike that I just went through right there. And I was already at a pretty decent level, so that's saying something. Ugh. Okay. Um. That's right. Okay, so these are also just the stone versions of ores, so that means that there's a good chance I'm gonna have to make a lot of room. Oh, never mind. There's a lot of chance I'm going to have to make room in my inventory. I don't have to make any changes whatsoever. I also really need to do something about accidentally pausing mid-game. Because, like... Clearly this is all still very real-time. I'm just trying to vein mine, and, you know... The fact that vein mine is tilde slash reverse apostrophe thing... It, uh... Isn't exactly helping. Oh, okay, so there are still more guys here. Um, purple gelatin, indigo crystal. I think I'm more likely to use... You know what? Um, light gray frameless glass. You can be used to bridge across. Thank you. Um, did that fall down? Uh, okay, I'm in my post, like, tension heightened brain scenario or whatever where... I can now feel myself slowing down. And that's unfortunate. That is unfortunate because that means that stuff like this. Okay, nope, nope. I feel the tension coming back. We're good. I, I'm back in the uh, fight response. This is fine. This is fine. There's just a chance that I'm gonna need like more food and or coffee after I'm done with this run, just to get me back into a semi-functional state. Boop. Oh, nope, not more Vindicators, not more Vindicators, no thank you. You know, on the plus side, I must be getting just a ton of shards out of this. Never mind, only five, really? I thought I had, like, some kind of a stacking modifier for cake layers or something like that. Huh? Maybe the damage doesn't go up nearly as much as I- oh, no. Okay, I have to- Oh, oh! Okay, the whoo. <laughs> Did I give myself like is there a passive regen skill that I just am not aware about? Do I have something on my armor maybe? I need to examine my loadouts at some point in time because I've noticed 
the last few volts that I do actually have some kind of regen going on here. Okay, there are definitely still more Vindicators. Okay, I say Vindicators, but realistically it could also be Pillagers. Because we do know... The sole distinction between the two is the weapon that they're using. The point is, there may be more baddies in here. Because I can hear the... Hey, hey. Uh, um... Uh, okay, you know what? I can try down. I might as well try down. I hate the fact... Of course, there are still more that we hadn't spotted. Oh! Oh boy. Nope, do not want... Enervated. That probably means, like, enemies are more lively or faster or... I'm gonna have to read that ex that uh, d description text after I finish these guys here. You know, get myself out of danger. I hear there's another spider, but I think we can take a look. Oh, healing in this vault is inefficient. Lovely. That's just great. Have a good old taste of the patented... It's not actually patented. Agent Omega Sarcasm here. Alright. Um, okay, we need to get rid of some stuff. And I think we get rid of the flowers just because... Oh, wait! But flowers are in the next, um... Flowers are in the next vault crystal, so maybe I should keep those. And just get a whole bunch on the way out, except... Wait, hold on. This is a cake vault. The way out is wherever I make it. Um, okay, burger pickles. Yeah, so... What else do I think I can get rid of? I can honestly get rid of the shulker shells at this point. I have so many excess shulker shells. Like... <clears throat> I may have gone end, quote-unquote, busting, but I didn't even really need to bust that much. Um, oh, you know what? Hold on. If I just grab this uh, tall lilac or whatever, I can plant it. Wait. Oh, I'm a spoon. Okay. That makes sense. Uh, 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 uh. So, the thing that I forgot is that uh, I'm pretty sure you do still need Silk Touch to pick up the two tall flowers. And honestly, it would have been a good idea to grab that. Because then I could just put it in the ground somewhere, bone meal it, and get a whole bunch of flowers. Without having to uh, like bone meal the ground or anything like that. But the other thing is, I don't know if that would cause me to pick up more too tall flowers. Oh, yeah, sure, now I get a dungeon. That's something. Wait. Oh, this is the exit. Um, extreme. Nope, not even going to pretend to entertain that. Oh, another key piece. Uh, oh, I don't have enough gold. Okay. Well, we have four key pieces. I don't know exactly how many you need to be able to do stuff, but let's try and find the cake piece here. Okay, we've... Oh, is this just straight up a dead end? This is just straight up a dead end. This is like the end of the road, friends. How... How does this vault work? I am now thoroughly confused. Have I, like, technically speaking, gotten as far as the vault will permit me to go, and at this point I'm just kind of in looting mode? I mean, unless I'm daft and I'm just not looking one of the th three... No, yeah, no. The, the, that's it. <laughs> there, There isn't more vault. It. This is the end, friend. Yep. So this is it. This is the part. When I was editing, I realized, yes, the entrance room only revealed the opening once I'd eaten the cake. And I think I just did every room after that fast enough that I didn't even notice that, you know, the three exits were closed until I'd eaten the cake. And so in this last room here, I just haven't found the cake. So of course the three exits would be closed. And I'm realizing that potentially I should have been playing this vault by just running through and eating as much cake as physically possible 
and then when it gets too hard, just duck back and hit one of the crake pylons. And so I think I mismanaged this vault. Mea culpa, let's resume with the video. Ow! Hole! Okay. Boop. Whew. Okay. Um. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, 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 um. Okay, I really like the sunstone stuff. Uh. What do I want to get rid of here? What do I want to get rid of here? Um. Eh. Oh, right. That's right. Uh, honestly, I'm not even going to bother with that. I'm going to wait for my MP to recharge. And I'm going to... I, I don't know. I guess try to find a different way down into there that doesn't involve jumping across a massive pit of lava. If I even can find another way through. Uh, I don't know. I mean, this is going to be very anticlimactic, but I'm pretty sure I'm just going to find one of the um, the cake things at this point in time and just, like, leave. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna call this vault just a little bit early. Because I'm, what, four or five layers deep into this cake? And while I'm sure there is, like, another slice down below somewhere, I... Don't fancy jumping across a pit of lava to get it. Uh, okay, let's see how this works. Boop. Oh, okay, you don't actually get the thing until just at the end. Let me see if there's anything I can get rid of here. Honestly, Bounty Pearl, I haven't been using them at all. There we go, straight into my inventory this will go then. We have just enough XP to level up. It's honestly not as much as I was expecting. So that makes me wonder if my charm has finally broken. Anyway, we got the most astonishingly not out of the objective. We got it out of mobs killed. Interesting. We got the next most out of mining blocks, then chests, and lastly the objective. That's astonishing. Okay, so we collected 20 coin piles, mined 37 ores, looted 31 chests and killed 171 mobs. We got four cake layers in deep. Uh, so I guess that four is potentially, I mean, I, unless there was one in the last room that I didn't know about, that was pretty much the best I think we could have done there. Um, so we got 25 wood chests, four living, two ornate. We already did the coin piles and we got a whole bunch of ores. I'm really appreciating the black opal. I think that's fairly rare. Um, Gorgonite. I think we've mostly gotten the vault version of that, but that's okay. The most XP dense XP mob is probably the shivers, I'm guessing. And in fact, this is true. Okay, so I need to do a little bit of inventory management because A, we have this crake, and B, we have the bounty chest to get. So I will cut to after that. Okay, so I guess first we'll start with the bounty one. We already know what it is. And I should turn my magnet back on. Yep, there we go. So we got some steel ingots. That was basically one of the things that I was really looking forward to because... I think that right there is enough for another cagearium cage. And we also got a mystery egg. And then, the crake. We got so many cakes. We got five cakes. I'm guessing one cake just for completing the thing, and then four additional layers? Maybe? But unfortunately, we didn't get any artifacts. I'm gonna have to think of what I want to do with all this cake. If I were in Botania, I know there is some kind of flower that consumes cake for MP. And we only have two items to identify today, so I think we're just going to do this the old-fashioned way. Hmm, looks like a diamond axe. Didn't have that transmog either, so that's okay. And actually, let me just shuffle a little more in frame here. I didn't have either of those transmogs. I 
you know, honestly, with the whole, well, no, I'm doing the whole wolf thing, and I kind of like having the wolf, like, as a cowl, or not a cowl, a shoulder thing, like a shawl, a wolf shawl. Uh, let's see what we have here. Wait, vault chest plate? Oh, because it's in my offhand. Yeah, right, of course. Um, or it's in my main hand, whatever, words. Uh, this is technically less raw attack damage. And everything else is just not even really worth considering, except for the shocking hit. That's pretty nice. But let's also see. I didn't have to leave my inventory for that. We have... The armor is looking good, but the fact that there's the reduction in ability power is kind of eh. Uh, I need to roll on that prefix before I really fully judge this, but I think the common chest plate loses, despite being, you know, 17 levels higher. And I think that's everything. That is going to do it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to like, subscribe, and click that bell to be notified. And as always, I'm looking forward to your feedback in the comments below. And with that, I will catch you on the flip side. Thanks for watching, everybody.